One of the best things about the internet is that it gives anybody a voice. But how does one get started? Simple, blogging. Blogging is one of the best ways to make your voice widely known, no matter the topic. Let's get posting. This is probably the most difficult part of blogging. To get started, consider your target audience. What are their needs and concerns? What topics might offer them value? How will your blog be unique? And be sure to keep track of these ideas in a notebook or some kind of device or app. Once you pick a post topic, create an outline. Outlining is a great way to visualize the flow of your post and will save you loads of time during the next step. As you start writing your post, try to ignore the impulse to edit your post as you write. There'll be time to polish up your first draft later, so for now, just get the words out. Careless typos and other errors just scream amateur, so be sure to eliminate any spelling and grammar errors. Take time to reduce irrelevant information and wordiness. And of course, check to make sure you're using reliable sources. The title of your post is critical to grabbing the attention of readers and search engines. Focus on staying accurate and avoid any clickbait tactics. Whether you take your own photos or purchase stock images, make sure every post has a graphical element of some kind. Search engine optimization might just be the most important word in a blogger's vocabulary. SEO means strategically using keywords, URLs, titles, and more to improve your rank on search engine result pages. For a more in-depth dive into SEO best practices, check out this video. Finally, hit that publish button. Think we're done? Almost, but not quite. Now that you've published your first blog post, share it on social media and use analytics to track your success. Most of all, engage with your audience. And remember, whether it's weekly, daily, or even monthly, publishing consistently is key to growing your audience. Now get blogging. And remember, comment, like, share, and subscribe for more useful tips on running your own website.